let's do a calculation involving standard enthalpies of formation and enthalpies of reactions. So, I want to calculate the enthalpy of formation for N2O5 gas, starting with some information. The information I have is the enthalpy of formation of NO gas and two reaction enthalpies. Now, if I know the enthalpy of formation of NO gas, I can write that chemical reaction that is associated with this. Because I know enthalpies of formation are the formation of the compound from the elements in their standard states. And this compound contains nitrogen and oxygen. Nitrogen in its standard state is N2 gas. Oxygen in its standard state is O2 gas. So I can write N2 gas plus O2 gas goes to 2 NO, just balancing that chemical equation. Of course, the enthalpy of formation is for a single mole. I formed two moles here. So this enthalpy is the enthalpy for one half this chemical reaction. I've got two here, so I'll just double this enthalpy. That enthalpy, 181 kilojoules. Now I want to find the enthalpy of formation for N2O5. I can write that because it's the enthalpy of formation, and again, it's a nitrogen-oxygen compound. So the enthalpy of formation reaction is nitrogen gas, 5 halves mole of oxygen gas, gives me a mole of N2O5. So I'd like to sum these to form this one. And I notice right off, well, this reaction here, that would give me 2 moles of N2O5 on the product side. I only want 1 mole. So I'm going to divide this one through by 2. If I divide this reaction through by 2, I have to divide the enthalpy by 2. So let's do that. And then when we add down, you'll see that these three reactions add to give the reaction we're looking for. So it's a Hess's Law situation. I can add these three, add their enthalpies to get the enthalpy for this unknown reaction. So when I add, I notice there's two moles of NO2 on both the product and reactant side. Those cancel. There's two moles here of NO2 and two moles here of NO2. Those cancel. And the rest add to give me a mole of nitrogen, five has mole of oxygen, and a mole of N2O5. So the sum of these three, I can add my three enthalpies, and the enthalpy for this reaction is 11 kilojoules per mole. It's slightly endothermic. I have to absorb 11 kilojoules per mole for every mole of N2O5 that I form from the elements in their standard states.